Uh, well, this is a story uh, about an astronaut who comes back to Earth having had a life-changing experience and that she finds um, after training her whole life for what is essentially the peak of her life, things aren't the same when she comes home. And uh, it's really a character piece that tracks her as she, as she tries to find that purpose, tries to get back if she can. Mm -hmm. Well, I think for us, uh, we'd say it's very loosely inspired. We sort of took uh, uh, a number of elements of the, the, the crime itself, and for us, we asked a question, how could something like this happen? And we think that this movie is a, a plausible um, explanation for something like this. You know, we grew up not too far from the Space Center in Florida. You know, uh, growing up, it was the sort of thing, if a shuttle launch happened, you stop everything. You look in the sky, you see flames uh, going across the sky. If it's at nighttime, night becomes day. It's incredible. But nobody really asks what it is that we um, that we task astronauts with. And we felt that the actual story that this was based on was a little reductive. And, uh, you know, we hope we did it justice. Yeah, I think for us, the, the big thing, we're learning about this project even now, five years after we sat down uh, to write it. Uh, in so many ways, it feels like uh, Lucy in the Sky is about, or for us, ended up being about writing Lucy in the Sky, because it's this yeah. thing of, you work your whole life to try and get to a place that so few people are like lucky enough, fortunate enough to get to. Uh, and then once you're there, the question is, what now? And what does this mean? And I, I think Elliot and I are from a small town in Florida, and the idea that we would ever write something that turned into all of this, uh, I don't think it ever seemed real to us growing up. Um, and I think it would, it would be hard for us to explain this situation to uh, everyone back at home. But I'm very glad that, you know, my best friend since I was 12 is here with me and I can turn to him and be like, oh, this is really happening, right? Like this is, this is what our lives are now. Uh, and he, he can understand. And I think that a lot of that actually ended up coming out in the movie. And uh, mm -hmm. it's been, it's been a, it's been a wild experience, and I can't believe we're here. Well, I I hope that that uh, building on something that Brian had said earlier, uh, everybody goes through setbacks and triumphs in their life, and everybody wants to share it with someone. And at the end of the day, this is a story about somebody who is really looking for a decent sense of empathy to reach out to somebody who uh, can say, "I get it." and really know that they mean it. Everybody says, I get it, but it's kind of a nice thing that you say. Um, if anybody could take away something from that, it's just the value of empathy, especially in the context of hard work.